blessed be friends. Join me as we adventure to several wonderful places in the Philippines and see the current situation of each area, and therefore giving you an up-to-date travel situation as it is in our journey. Ride with me with my ever so faithful cafe for 100 motorcycle and let us visit together some coffee shops, restaurants, resorts and several more wonderful spots in the Philippines that some may not even know that exist. Today we are on adventure to explore Guta de Calarea, but not in Quezon province. And yet we shall experience the very the same Guto flavor in San Pedro Laguna. But first, do like and subscribe here in Lobo Viajero YouTube channel. Yes, like and subscribe here and let the journey begin. On our way to San Pedro Laguna, we will riding through Southwoods Avenue, right to Rosario Complex, straight to Amisolo Street, then turn right again to Juan Yuna Street, and finally to Mananzala Street. And our ride here is nice and smooth, wonderful weather a bit cloudy, but that's okay. It makes our ride more pleasant and not so warm, perhaps around 27 degrees centigrade. So far all road are well paved and traffic flow is light, there's really no need to rush your day, simply enjoy this beautiful country with lavish green surroundings, smooth ride that brings smile to my lips. Which remind me to always be respectful to all, let us not be an insecure bully that always needs to prove themselves, and keep on bullying others just to satisfy their ego, in other words simply respect yourselves. Here we are entering Southwoods, a prominent residential and commercial development located in San Pedro Laguna, Philippines, situated at the boundary of San Pedro and Binan cities. It enjoys excellent connectivity to major roads, such as the Southwoods on Expressway, making it easily accessible from Metro Manila and other neighboring provinces. Its proximity to commercial centers, schools, hospitals, and recreational facilities adds to its appeal as an ideal place to live and work. Moreover, the place boasts a range of commercial establishments, including shopping malls, restaurants, and entertainment hubs, making it a self-sufficient community where residents can meet their daily needs conveniently. With its well-planned infrastructure, green spaces, and top-notch facilities, it continues to attract individuals and families looking for a balanced urban lifestyle in the vibrant city of San Pedro. It's a bit confusing here, because I found out that the restaurant that we are searching is misplotted in the map, but it's alright, just by the other side of the street. Just post a while and look around and you'll be able to see it. Well, all is well.
I found it. Cuto de Calirea is at number one of Man and Sailor Street Chrysanthemum Village, San Pedro Laguna. You will be satisfied with the prompt service usual by the owner herself. Good food at a very good price, plus a relaxing ambience inside. Situated at the corner of Man and Sala and Balikar Street is our destination, go to De Calirea. It looks like Google Map needs to be updated because it is actually on the other side of the street. Same corner, but on the other side. Ho ha ha ha. The journey to go to De Calirea is also a delightful experience itself, as travelers pass through scenic countryside roads and picturesque landscapes, enhancing the overall sense of adventure and discovery. Here is a nice, quiet neighborhood, so peaceful, clean. Lots of green vegetation and not crowded. Definitely a good discovery, your journey is worth it. With the cool and refreshing breeze coming from all the trees adds to the experience, making the visit all the more enjoyable. Aside from its delicious food, the place has tranquil ambience that complements the surrounding natural beauty. Puto di Cali Raya is a popular destination nestled in the serene and picturesque town of San Pedro Laguna. It is a charming eatery that offers a unique culinary experience. Drawing locals and tourists alike with its delectable specialty guto is something you must really try. Goto di Cali Raya has mastered the art of preparing this dish to perfection making it a go-to place for those seeking a taste of authentic Filipino cuisine. The kuto is a traditional Filipino dish. Its type of rice porridge made with glutinous rice and ox tripe. It is a beloved comfort food known for its rich and flavorful broth, tender tripe, and the delightful medley of toppings like crispy garlic, spring onions, and hard boiled eggs, topped by the yummy chichuron, makes all the difference. This kuto is the epitome of comfort food. Its warm and soothing nature makes it perfect for rainy days or when someone is feeling under the weather. Considered a dish that provides comfort and brings back fond memories of home-cooked meals. Served with a variety of toppings, such as crispy garlic, chopped spring onions, hard-boiled eggs, and do not forget chicharron crispy pork skin. Yes, these toppings are texture and enhance the overall flavor profile of the dish. The rice adds a comforting texture, while the tripe offers a good source of protein and other essential nutrients. This has become a cherished dish that brings people together, whether it's for a simple breakfast or a bonding moment with loved ones. Its enduring popularity speaks volumes about its appeal and the special place it holds in Filipino hearts and plates. Besides from its covered alfresco setup, 
the place also have this roomy open garden where you could really enjoy the freshness of mother nature and surround it with this big trees around that gives a restful shade. The plant selection are well suited to the location climate and soil conditions. These native plants are a good choice as they are adapted to the local environment and require less maintenance. This could also be a place for your small gatherings or a delightful meeting place. Enough space for your small party and private to keep your guests secure. The beauty of an open garden lies not only in its visual appeal, but also in the sensory experience it provides. It engages all our senses, bringing us closer to nature and creating lasting memories of serenity and wonder. Beyond its aesthetics, the garden also contributes to a healthier environment. It supports local biodiversity, helps purify the air, conserves water and promotes sustainable gardening practices. The garden showcases the beauty of nature in its purest form. The unrestricted layout allows for a seamless integration of plants, flowers, trees, and other natural elements, creating a harmonious and visually pleasing environment. Around the restaurant are solid hardwood furniture that are naturally warm, durable, unique, and age gracefully. It's an embodiment of craftsmanship, and its presence adds a touch of elegance and sophistication to any living space. Each piece of hardwood furniture is unique in its own ways due to the distinct grains and patterns in the wood. A natural variations gives each furniture its character and charm, making it a work of art in its own right. Just remember Guto di Carli Raya in San Pedro Laguna brings you the flavor of Carli Raya Guto from Quezon province for you to experience it here. And then, smile. Truly it's another beautiful day that the Lord has made, so let us rejoice and be glad in it. But do not forget to subscribe. Yes, subscribe to this YouTube channel and you will be so blessed. Always ride safe and ride another day. Lobo Viajero here wishing you all, merry meet and merry part.